What could be interesting? Search nice things. Nice things? What yeah. do you want to search, Mouse? Search for... Iron Mouse. I can search Iron Mouse on my channel. Iron Mouse? Yeah, let's see what comes up if I type in Iron Mouse. Wait, nothing? No, that's not right. That can't be right. I must have typed it wrong. Oh, yeah, there we go. Iron Mouse question mark? <laughs> uh... What? <laughs> yeah, it's pretty funny. Wait, I, what I, is it? I liked seeing the Iron Mouse milk in his fridge. That sounds like a... I feel like that could have been worded slightly better. <laughs> Iron Mouse finna roast this man's apartment. I can't wait for Iron Mouse to react to this. To the milk? Uh, this is uh, on my uh, moving apartment video. All of these comments on Iron Mouse are all on my apartment moving video. Oh, no, and the Didus one as well. Well, I watched the Didus one. Yeah. Washed up. Um, I watched... Uh, I watched the apartment one. Yeah. But only because you asked me to. I was... Not because I watched it, because I wanted to. Oh, yeah, because I was like, uh, does this look like... Can you see anything bad? Yeah. Out the window. I was like, can you check? Uh, Am I crazy? <laughs> yeah. My meetup ended at like 3 a.m. How, how was it? It was good. I met mm -hmm. up with Yeah, you do people. a Patreon meetup, right? Where you talk to them. Uh, yeah. Yeah, they got like uh, 10 minutes, right? To talk to you? Yeah, I do. I do Patreon meetups once a month. And uh, I meet with like uh, four, three to four people at a time for yeah. 10 minutes. That's quite a lot. Quite yeah, a lot I met with a lot of people. We started at like 3 o'clock and we ended at 3 a.m. What? Yeah. That's, that's, uh, that's a long time. There's a lot of people to meet and say hi to. Bro, what? Hmm? <laughs> what? What? <laughs> 12 hours? How do I you, had a break. How do you stay engaged? I, I feel like after like three hours of uh, meeting people, you, your brain gets fried. What are you talking about? I love talking to people. All right. Paid actor. I love talking to new people every day. Mm. Paid actor? What the fuck does that mean? <laughs> what do you, uh... Well, I mean, so in 10 minutes, right? What's the normal flow? How do they, like, introduce... Do they introduce themselves or are they just, like... Or they, like, get right no, into it? They ask you a question. No, because a lot of them that I meet, like, I've already... They've already been coming mm. to see me every month. Yeah. So... So, sometimes uh, they'll talk to me about like uh, things that are going on in their life, or sometimes I'll tell a joke, or I'll act really weird, or I'll yeah, say yeah. something funny, and 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 we'll do random fun stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my God. I'm not an introvert. I'm an extrovert. <laughs> Connor's an extrovert too. What the fuck? Yeah, I know. We we talk about. You're an uh, extrovert too. We talk about interacting with fans. I think on the the Trash Day episode that's coming out next. I think. Oh yeah. I think so. Can't remember. Just trying to be honest about it, because you know, a lot of the time it's uh, it's a very touchy subject, because um, you it's you know you can't say more often than not you can't say negative things, because um, mm. you know they're your they're your viewers and you know, but I think there is a, <laughs> I think you can talk about it and be realistic, and not yeah. not like piss everyone off, but try and be honest and try and explain it in a way, but a lot of people don't feel comfortable talking about it. Yeah, I get it. A lot, a lot of people will never like talk about that topic because it's very t people don't want to risk anything. But I feel like if I you can if you can be transparent with your audience that and you can do it in a way that's respectful, it's normally True. normally normally does better and people trust you more. Yeah, I agree. Yeah, yeah. I can't remember what we talked about. I know there was um, I can't remember what exactly we said. I'm trying to think how the conversation went because we recorded it like five weeks ago. <sighs> Where did it go? Somewhere in your brain. There's, n I have like notes. I have like parts where I remember of what we were speaking about, but I can't remember the full thing and how, how the flow went. Yeah, I can't spoil it. Yeah, mm -hmm. I won't spoil all of it. There was, I think sometimes there was just like, uh, I think we spoke about at one point there was like. How do you respond to like very odd 
messages or uh, when someone's in, in like in person, if they like say something really really bizarre, like how do you how do you handle that? <laughs> it's difficult because yeah. like you don't want to be you don't want to be like hey that's weird, but also you don't want to like sometimes you're like is it because you know I, I think a lot of we didn't we didn't say this in it, but sometimes I see people on Twitter who like are always just looking for like a fight to like correct their fans or whatever, and they're always like you can't do this behavior it's rude to me, but also it's like. Sometimes you're like, man, do you really need to take every fight? Do you really need to like, if someone like asked a question that was uncomfortable, sometimes you can just be like, just get over it. Just move on. It's not worth fighting. I see. Do you know? Because I've seen, um, I saw a Twitter post where somebody was like, uh, someone messaged a content creator and uh, they asked the content creator, when are you uploading next? And mm -hmm. the content creator tweeted it out being like, um, I, I, I'm not, I'm not your machine, and it's not fair for you to put pressure and anxiety on me. And I was like, Yeah, but why did you have to tweet that out? Though? Yeah, I, 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 I was thinking, I was like, Do you really need to like? Is it really that bad? I think, I, I think it's, I think it's okay for someone to ask you when's people, the next upload. Like, I was like, People ask me things all the time. People ask me stuff like that all the time, and I yeah. just see it as they're passionate and they're excited, and they, yeah. they, they. they they're just really excited to see more stuff from you, so... Yeah. And they you know? were, they, I remember they tweeted out, they were like, I have mental health problems, and it's really inappropriate for you to ask me when my next upload is. And I was like, bro, I'm sure they... Okay. I'm sure they didn't intend to, like, mentally attack you. I was like, chill, man. Like, it's... Yeah, I don't know. I just wish... Sometimes I feel like we're on the internet, and I'm like, everyone is just insane. Like, why is everyone like... Why can't everyone just, like, chill out? And just, like, think about things. Like rationally, I don't know. I just like when I go on Twitter, I think I'm either weird one because I'm not getting angry about everything all the time. Yeah, I think uh, I think we're weird. <laughs> yeah, a fan of your work, they're pretty eager to see it, you know. And in my head, yeah, it's like you're excited. yeah, I was like, in what capacity is that a negative thing? Oh, my mom's like vacuuming. Oh, go on, sorry, go ahead, go ahead. That's cute. Go on, sorry, what you're saying. No, it's just like when people, like when people, I get tons of questions about multiple things, mm -hmm. and I never get upset at somebody asking me a question, you know? Right, yeah. Unless like you're like super rude to me, and even if you are rude to me, like I'm not gonna be like, let me tweet this out and tell everyone what's happening. Yeah. Like, what the fuck? I, uh, I, you know, I, I think you have. Oh God, this vacuum is so annoying. I think you have a right to like be able to shut down toxic behavior, but I also think you have to be careful with what you choose to shut down. Because yeah. if every single Tuesday you're tweeting out about something that you're trying to stop your audience from doing, it's just like, oh, it's just not going to mean anything. That that Dyson is going hard. Goddamn, that's how <laughs> Max suck, bro. Oh God, um, is your is your whole house carpeted? No, um, the stairs are only carpeted. Oh. Yeah, my dad, my dad, uh, has a very, uh, crazy vacuum, too. Really? Yeah. Why is it my crazy? dad does the vacuuming. It's very loud. It's not a Dyson, though. I don't know what the fuck it is. It's some, like, industrial strength vacuum. <laughs> I used to have the Henry Hoover one. You know, have you ever seen those ones with, like, googly eyes on them? Oh, yeah. No, his is, like, uh... This is like a, like a garage vacuum cleaner. Oh. That he brought in the house. And it's so loud. Probably does the job there. It does. It does. <laughs> every UK school. Yeah, every single UK school had that one. They're really cute. They just like don't pick up anything. With the googly eyes? They have eyes on them and like the nose is like the, 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 the tube is the nose. And it's, yeah, they're everywhere in the UK. They're literally everywhere. But they don't pick up anything. They're like, you put them over a carpet and it just won't pick up anything. Like a fucking tiny dirt devil. Those things don't pick up shit either. Yeah.